about 13,000 light years from Earth. Astronomers have discovered a vast cloud of high energy particles called a wind nebula around a rare ultramagnetic neutron star or magnetar. It is the first wind nebula ever found around a magnetar. The magnetar was first discovered by NASA's SWIFT satellite in 2011. Using data from the European Space Agency's XMM Newton X ray telescope, a team of international scientists identified the wind nebula after finding an unusual glow about 15 light years across, centered on the magnetar. Magnetars are extremely rare. Only 29 out of the 2,600 known neutron stars have been classified as magnetars. A neutron star is the crushed core of a massive star that exploded as a supernova. Magnetars are ultra-compact types of neutron stars that erupt randomly with powerful high-energy flares. They are the strongest magnets in the universe with magnetic fields more than 100 trillion times stronger than Earth's. The scientists say they don't know yet how the magnetar developed and how it continues to maintain a wind nebula. Until now, nebulas had only been seen around young pulsars, which are rapidly rotating neutron stars. They emit particles and electromagnetic radiation that form the wind nebula. Scientists believe that the expanding shell of supernova remnants prevents the particles around young pulsars from flowing out into space. But after a few thousand years, the shell becomes weak, the particles leak out, and the nebula fades away. The scientists say the newfound nebula has surprisingly been able to store the magnetar's energetic outflow for many thousand years. They hope that more research around this discovery will provide new insights into the characteristics of magnetars and why this is the only one with a nebula.